Now, good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. There's the whistle. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Bernd Leno. I think his presence might make all the difference for this team. He's got lightning-fast reactions and uh, a coolness under pressure that allows him to make the big one-on-one -on -one saves. He's also very reliable under the high ball or when he's dealing with crosses, and I'd expect the whole defence to play with a bit more assurance with him in place. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. Michel Hanolu. And it's Ibrahimovic. Samu Kasti has a pop! And he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Defending of the desperate variety. Romagnoli tries to stroke it through. Goes for goal! A real chance and a real let-off. Well, he accepted the invitation to have a pop and that defence was confident he wouldn't succeed. Tierney, Aubameyang, can't get the better of his opposite number. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. You can get that clear. And here's Chalhanolu. Rebic. He's in! Big chance! Goal! Milan! And Milan have the lead. What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Aubameyang pushes to get on the end of it. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. The move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Lobs it in gently. 
tries to get it clear. Great leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Ibrahimovic certainly rose so well there. I fancied him to put that away too. Been one straight back, and here's William. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Timely intervention, and that's clear cut. It's a free kick. Keeper's got good distance on that. Chalanolu looks to dink one in. Ibrahimovic! Back of the net! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. That's wonderfully done. Chris Pitch, true finish. Well, most of those go high and wide because of their difficulty. He made it look like he does it every day. starting to look very comfortable that second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods I mean one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three John gets into the right position to intercept goes long doesn't get the pass he's looking for keeper sends it forward Leno sends that a long way. Hoists it forward. Forward it goes. Looking for space out wide. Samu Castillejo. Diogo Dallo is charging up on the overlap. And out to safety. And the header! Oh, denied brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. And the whistle goes for half time. Do it back on the first 45 minutes. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Milan ahead 2 0, and they are looking good. So we're just settling back into this second half. Across the field it goes. Well, that's where he wants it. He's through the middle. Tierney tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. And that's a foul. A simple decision for the referee. Diogo Dallo. Romagnoli. And they've been caught out here. Strong 
challenge, but well within the laws. That's a decent ball. He's a Rubic! They are rampant! And they are cruising away. Oh, that always looked the likely outcome. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Milan take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Tierney. The message is clear. None shall pass. What a good way to assert your authority for this second period. They were prepared to commit numbers forward into attacking positions, and the risk is... Shut a goal! Oh, that is an awful miss. Milan were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Kia. Played out to the right. And it's Chalhanolu. are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. He snuffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. That defence must be sick of the sight of him. He's been persistent and ruthless all game. He just hasn't stopped working. Milan tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Tierney. Ibrahimovic. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or in. Shoots! Put out the best in the keeper. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. It's wide. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Granit Xhaka. Partey. Granit Xhaka. David Luiz. Partey, Mitsu Babia, and Lacazette. Hoists it high, played into space out wide. Bayorin. Ibrahimovic is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Well, he helps himself to a treble, Peter, and then they switch on. It's a bit late now. He's gone for it! 
Tessier. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Hit long and direct. Uh, needed a better pass there. Partey. The referee's awarded a free kick. Saka battles to win it back. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. to a minimum of four minutes additional time. Cedric Suarez. Now it's William. Oh, what a... Look at it! No, that's just wide. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Milan, comfortable winners, a virtuoso display, utterly one-sided. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That eases the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient 